Hello guys, welcome to Gusto's New Music Fridays. Uh, we're back again and we have several loads of good music to share with you today. If you're wondering why New Music Friday, Friday has been set as the international release day for music, uh, singles and albums. And there's over 40 labels who have joined in, in this act. That's why you see a lot of people with these songs on Friday. Also, playlists have been updated every Friday across all stores, Apple Music, Spotify, Tidal, Deezer. Everyone updates the playlist on Friday. So artists take, uh, they make use of the opportunity of releasing songs today so they can be considered and have the, the, the quick boost of playlists to their songs. I'm going to be putting you through all the songs that have come out over the past week. And today being Friday, there's, there's loads of them. Uh, I'll be back in a bit. Welcome back guys, so we're going to start off with DJ Copy. Uh, if, you, if you're aware, DJ Copy has been releasing singles since 2017. Uh, her first song, her first official song was with Techno, Green Light. And over, since then she has dropped single after single and people have always been at her and told her you don't know how to sing, go back to your DJ or do things like that. But she has gone back to the drawing board, she has uh, worked on herself, a bit of professional development, voice training and she's back with an, uh, with an album and the album is seriously, seriously sick. One of the best projects that I've dropped today. Uh, it's titled Original Copy and uh, from, the, from the album I, I listened overnight, um, I'm going to pick four songs that I feel are really, really good off the album. The first one is uh, Feel Good featuring Fireboy DML. Uh, the song is really nice and Fireboy just dropped an album. Uh, we're going to talk about him as well. Um, there's also Little Lit featuring Tenny. Uh, Tenny and Fuse really came quite on this jam. Like if you listen it uh, if, and you're sitting down, you're not dancing, then you're a long thing. There's also 54 with Julian Mali and there's, uh, there's also the song, the song with Stoneboy which we shared with you last week. Uh, that's one of the dope songs of the album. Fireboy's original copy is dope. It's just 30 minutes long or 31 minutes long. I feel you should go listen to that. Uh, next on our list is Fireboy DML, YBNL's golden boy at the moment. He has a new album out called Apollo which dropped yesterday, Thursday. And off the album, uh, there's several good songs but I'm going to be going with four of those songs. Apart from the ones that have already been released, which are AD, uh, uh, New York City Girl, and and, um, and then we have songs like Favorite Song. Favorite Song is a song about the 90s, like let's pretend it's 1990 something and get it popping. So that song was really mad from Fireboy. It shows his versatility that he can do songs uh, that are from, from way back then and he can do current pop songs. And Fuse was also mad on that production. Uh, we also have uh, Airplane Mode uh, from the album. We also have uh, Afar with Olamide, one of the dope songs of the album. There's also a song titled Go Away. Go Away is a very nice song, very nice love song. Like if you're loving someone and they're not loving you back, you want the feelings to go away. And I think they should go and play this song in the Big Brother house for Lakon. <laughs> I think they should go and play it for him. Maybe you'll catch his stuff and then his head will come correct. So the album is already getting good reviews at the moment and it's one of the best things that have come out. A lot of people are raving about it. I think you guys should listen to that and let us know what your favorite tracks on it are. Then we're going to move on to K1, The Ultimate. Baba has an EP out. If you remember uh, two weeks ago when we talked about his Awade song and I said to myself, I want to keep my thoughts to myself to see how the rest of the project goes. Well, I've listened to the rest of the project and I did like it. And off it, I've picked two songs that I feel you'd like. The first one being um, the one with uh, Omo Ninja featuring Tenny. Omo Ninja is a, you know this Omo Ninja? Those are the kind of vibe we used to enjoy from K1 as, you know, at several parties and he brought the pop feel. Shout out to um, Maestro, shout out to Bankoli for the work with K1 The Ultimate. It's innovative and I think other Fuji artists will want to follow suit and do the same if they see how this has gone through. There's also um, Thinking About You featuring Toby Gray. Toby Gray and K1 The Ultimate actually had lyrics in French on this song so yes it was mind-blowing you need to listen to that and also check out the other tracks on the ep it's a good listen uh, i think about 20 28 minutes long or thereabouts or less so you need to check that out we're going to move on to ag baby is your baby ag baby has a new album out afro pop volume one he has teased this album for quite a while and he has released two songs of it which people already like to uh, something different and ag baby and people are already looking forward to listening to more jams like that on this album. Well, if you're a fan of AG Baby and something different, then you're definitely gonna love this album. Of it, I have um, four favorites that I feel you guys will like. There's Sabina, which was pretty nice. It has a mix of new AG and old 
ng there's exclusive featuring olayinka ehi olayinka ehi was 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 immense in that I, I i i i didn't know what to expect but once i heard her parts i think i really really loved her performance on that song there's also water carry me which is just classic adekule gold of the past two albums so water carry me and then there's, there's also pretty lady with um with uh, what's his name uh Pato ranking, so that was that was really a, a dope jam as well. I think you should check it out. Overall, I think it's a pretty decent album for Meiji Baby. Uh, uh, it's, it's come up into a new a new form of style for him, and I think he's working out well. He has more fans, not just in Nigeria and outside the country as well. And I think that's the goal for any artist, any serious artist in Nigeria. Get the international fans; they're the ones that pay you money. Then also we have Fouls with one trouser. I think Fouls just dropped this jam, just making it be like I know he dropped something. <laughs> That's what I feel it is. I think making it be like I know he dropped something. Fouls has a new song out called One Trouser. Then there's Shay Shay with Twali featuring Zlatan, Small Doctor, and YC. Imagine the lineup: Zlatan, Small Doctor, and YC. That song uh, has a bit of Atilogu vibe, has a bit of what YC has done in the past with Jagaban. Uh, it's not a bad song. Uh, we know uh, Shei Shei is more of a uh, R&B kind of mid-tempo kind of artist, but she did, did, did uh, she did she did well on, on on this track, and it's commendable how I mean people want to show that they're versatile, and this is one of those instances, and she didn't really go wrong on that. Then there's also um, Tori Kichi, that's Naomi's new artist. Uh, they are with a new song titled Yoga featuring Naomi. Um, I think I want to wait for another song from, 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 from the first lady of Malian music. Uh, I think she can do better, but the Naomi factor is there and people actually, people, some people do like it already because there's Naomi on there. And I think uh, time will tell how good all these artists that Naomi has signed onto his label will do. Then we have Rexy with Okwa remix. Okwa, the original was off Rexy's EP, Afro Streets. Uh, the, EP, uh, the remix is with Zlatan Ibile and Ladipo. Uh, Ladipo now jumps on anything. He's like one of the hottest rappers at the moment. He can he name pop, he can do it. Uh, hardcore rap, he can do it and every other thing he can do. So shout out to Ladipo, shout out to Zlatan for the Opal remix. Then there's Big Brother by Black Bones. Yes, the Haba Haba. So finally, Black Bones has moved on from the Haba 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 and I think people will stop <laughs> People will stop spamming everywhere with Haba right now. So there's a new song out with Big Brother, and then I think it has some sort of collaboration or partnership with AS Roma. Um, uh, AS Roma, and if, you, if, you, if you're on Twitter, you see that the AS Roma Pigeon account actually tweets, and probably I think they sent an official jersey to him, and he's, shoot, he's shooting some clips with these new songs for them. Then there's Nobody with DJ Neptune, Joe Boy, Mr. Easy. You know that song's already a smash hit, probably song of the year already so there's a new mix of it the ama piano mix ama piano is a south african um genre i don't i won't call it genre it's a south african style of music uh, south african house jazz all mixed together so there's a nobody ama piano version that has come out today and again i think they're just dropping this to disrupt the new guys who have come up with new content it's not it's not a bad song you should you should, you should definitely check it out then there's Bobo, uh, Bobo rather, Bobo with Casey. Uh, if you've listened to Wood Boys, um, what's it called? Audio Money. This is like another version of Wood Boys Audio Money. Casey is just basically saying all these people that want to Bobo us with uh, fake uh, lifestyle or fake world, and <laughs> even the people that are doing it legitly with, with but are still Boboing us. I mean, Casey is one of those people. Although the money might be legit, but then I don't know, but. You still Bobo us with all your wealth and all your flashy pictures. And I think Bobo is a decent song and you should listen to it. Then there's also Melvito and Gabzi. Melvito and Gabzi had worked on an EP before and this is a new song from the pair. And uh, Melvito is, is a dope producer. Gabzi is a dope young artist and this is not a bad song from them. Then we have DJ Lambo. DJ Lambo, A Tale of Two, a Tale of Two EP came out today. Uh, the song, the single of it dropped last week and we updated you guys. The song with Lady Donley and Inyanya. That was a dope song. Now off the EP, there's two songs that I feel will do really well. There's Party Day featuring Buju. Uh, Buju is Bonner's artist on the spaceship and one of the dope young guys out there right now. There's also Shapali with Ice Prince and CK. You should check out DJ Lambo's EP, one of the dope plays that have come out today. That's all I'm going to have time for today, guys. I'll be back in the G feed to tell you my song of the day.
So, my song of the day. Welcome back, guys. My song of the day. I'm going to go with DJ Copy and Tenny on that madness called Little Lit. That's my jam of the day. And I think that jam is the best thing that has dropped today. It's going to be the number one song on our playlist, which I'm going to put the link in the description. Little Lit by Tenny, uh, by DJ Copy and Tenny. Who are, who are we to complain when we have two Nigerian female artists collaborating? Who are we to complain? We love it. We want more of these kind of things. And I really love that DJ Copy put light to that in our, EP, uh, in our album. And I absolutely love that. So that's my song of the day. You, uh, go through the playlist as well. Let us know what song is your song of the day that got released over the past week until today. Our playlist is updated every week with all the new songs. You can check out the link in the description. If you feel we missed any song, do let us know in the comments so we can add to the playlist. And if you're an upcoming artist and you want us to consider your song for Gusto New Music Fridays, kindly send us an email or DM. You can DM me, you can DM any, any member of the team, or you can leave a comment in the, in, in the, on the video and we'll get back to you. That's all we have time for today, guys. See you next week, Friday, on Gusto New Music Fridays.